This past Saturday, the Rotary Club of Fawn Hill held the 2023 Family Farm Fest. It's one of many events Rotary holds every year to raise money for their community initiatives. Rotary Club of Fawn Hill um, raises uh, between I'd say 25 and 35,000, sometimes 40,000 a year. It's hard to say right now coming out of the pandemic. We've just started ramping up with our activities, but uh, the money that we raise goes right back into our communities, uh, as well as to um, international projects as well. Tell us a few of the projects Rotary has coming up that this money goes to. The Rotary Club has several events throughout the year and we try to find events that will um, you know, fit different um, demographics. So for example, uh, the Farm Fest here today is one of our fundraisers. We have a purse bingo in the fall. We do um, a golf tournament as well, um, it'll be in September. And uh, then one of our biggest fundraisers is the TV auction. Of course, your TV, one of our favorites, sponsoring that TV auction every December. We asked fellow Rotarian Paul Snack how they came up with the idea for Family Farm Fest. Well, it evolved from our original uh, uh, annual event called Fun Fest. Uh, we held it at Bissell's Hideaway and uh, plans changed and uh, we uh, looked for a new site which uh, White Meadows Farms stepped up, uh, offering their facility to, to, uh, to, to host this. And uh, with the fact that we're on a farm, we thought, you know what, we're going to have to change it up a bit. Could we uh, rebrand? And we did. We rebranded to Family Farm Fest from Fun Fest. So it was a nice, uh, uh, easy segue for us. And uh, the whole idea behind this was to raise money for local charities and uh, not-for-profits in and around the Niagara region. Uh, it's something that uh, is important to us at the Rotary Club. It's one of our biggest fundraisers of the year. So, Talk about some of the things you have going on here and some of the vendors you have here. Well, we have uh, well over 40 vendors uh, from all walks of life in the agricultural world. We also have a number of educational uh, organizations who have come. Skills Ontario have brought their, their tech truck and uh, kids can learn all about the various technologies uh, and professions out there, carpentry, electrical, plumbing, all that kind of stuff. They can actually learn uh, this stuff hands-on. We have uh, uh, simulators, computer simulators from the 4-H club, uh, teaching people about the, uh, the 4-H and farming uh, business. Um, we've got the uh, Federation of Agriculture from the Agri Federation of Agriculture here, uh, along with uh, the Dairy Farmers of Ontario. and. Uh, you name it, anybody in the farming world is here. We've got cows, we've got uh, chicks, baby chicks, we've got uh, uh, sheep shearing, we've got goats, we've got donkeys, mini horses, you name it, we've got it. So, oh, something I didn't mention, we have real live unicorns. Uh, they're, they're, they're giving uh, free rides uh, uh, to the little ones and uh, they're quite exciting, quite exceptional. They, they actually are quite magical. Where's the money that you raise go every year? So um, we support uh, a lot of community causes. Um, we look after environmental issues. We're doing a big tree planting initiative this fall, for example. Um, food for kids, so food security. Uh, food insecurity is big in our community, so that's um, you know various nutritional partners for food in schools. And um, we uh, raise money for, so I had mentioned international projects, so there's um, you know, water issues, health issues in other parts of the world. We will uh, fund some of those projects as well. Uh, big Brothers Big Sisters in our community, uh, so some, some examples. To find out more about the Fawn Hill Rotary Club and their events, go to rotarycluboffawnhill.ca.